All right, listen up. We are looking for anything that looks like drugs or paraphernalia. Philadelphia Police Department, we have a search warrant. What is that smell? I mean, you got to see this. Is this normal? I don't know. I've never been in an abortion clinic before. You are not going to believe what I saw last night. How many? So far, we found over 30 of them. Healthy woman goes into a clinic, comes out dead, and there's no police report? Files have been moved recently. Look at this. You'll be the prosecutor who went after reproductive rights, and you'll be a racist to boot. You've got a lot of folk who'd like to see abortion outlawed. And this is not going to be the case that gives them an excuse. Prosecution has offered you a plea bargain, Dr. Gosnell. And I would have to admit I was guilty. I'm not guilty. When you get to the courthouse, you are going to be swarmed by reporters. You ready for this, counselor? Where is everybody? When was the last time your division inspected Dr. Gosnell's clinic? We had instructions directly from Governor Ridge's office not to inspect. Wouldn't testify in that case about anything. You doubt you'll find a doctor who will. And you look at the facts, you will see what I see. An overly zealous Catholic investigator. Back Is that what you want to make this about? There's nothing that man did that protects women or children. And you don't have to be a pro-life activist to see that. Kermit Gosnell is perhaps the most prolific serial killer in American history. You better win. coming at me for my music, but you listen to this old stuff. Old oh, stuff? What? You better get up out of here with all that pockets of truth. Well, I got a boyfriend. Yeah, I heard, but it's all good. Really? We've been together our whole lives, Star. We got time. My name is Star. Two R's. Daddy named me that. Garden Heights. Mama and Daddy says our life is here, because our people are here. We got Mr. Rubin's Barbecue, Mr. Lewis's Barbershop, and Daddy's Store. The high school is where you go to get junk, high, or pregnant. We don't go there. Williamson is another world, so when I'm here, I'm Star version 2. Yo, those kids are lit! Basically, Williamson Star doesn't give anyone a reason to call her ghetto. And I hate myself for doing it. Until the weekend comes around. I get those goosebumps every time. What's up? Where you been at? I, mean, I don't know. You be hanging with all the white kids. Shut up. Yeah, when you're not around, when you go that to the side. Out of the car. Yo, Star, you okay? Go back where he told you. Go out. I'm not playing. Go back where he told <laughs> What did you do? Today, Garden Heights is reeling after the shooting of a 17-year-old black teenager by a white police officer. We live in a complicated world. It doesn't seem that complicated to me. Violence, brutality. It's the same story, just a different name. When I attack with impact, it's real tactful. The back cat waited and sat, debated to- It's best if she don't talk to father. He's threatening her. The only true power is the power within the people. It's about more than just color. It's about black people, poor people, everybody at the bottom. I need to speak for him. You to think we could never achieve the inconceivable. We don't belong, but we hear unbelievable. When you're ready to talk, you talk. Don't ever let nobody make you be quiet. I ain't named you Star by accident. Uncle Jonathan. Are you wearing a robe? It's a kimono. Here we are. Home sweet home. You're Lewis, I presume. How was your trip? This old hag is my neighbor. 
I'm relieved to see you didn't inherit your uncle's freakishly oversized head. My god, did that withered purple skeleton just speak? You'll see, it's quite different here. Have a look around. You're perfectly safe. That's safe? As long as it's fed. Do you know what a warlock is, Lewis? A boy witch. I think they're a little more than boy witches. Are you saying that you're a warlock? Please teach me, please, please. Okay, have it your way. I can give you the right books, teach you the right spells, but that last 1%, that's up to you. I don't want the creepy little runt. Think I want him? Ah! Lucky shot. You've told Lewis everything? Well, not everything. Do you hear the ticking? Ticking, ticking. This house used to be owned by another warlock. He's very wicked. Very powerful. He left a hidden clock in the walls. We don't know what it does except something horrible. Three gongs. Last time it was four. What happens when it gets down to one? Nothing good, that's for certain. We have to destroy the clock. So creepy. You can't do this alone. I can help you. You want to see some real magic? I'll show you. Shall we? God, I hate pumpkins. <laughs> Did you see that? Like this fry. is the grill for you. I call it the Obama. Como te llamas, me llamo the pit bull. I call this the big black machine. Oh. <laughs> Lisa, you're the best thing that ever happened to me. Oh my God. Do you smell gas? A little bit. Came out, but I was nervous. That's just a quick okay. one. Um, no, that's, um. Ah! Ah! I got 13 degree burns on my ass. You're the best salesman I've ever seen. I can see you being a stockbroker like me. Can't you give me a job? I wish I could. My boss won't let me hire a dropout. Look at Mark Zuckerberg. He dropped out of Harvard. You dropped out of Piedmont High. I was a couple credits shy of graduating. I got to get my GED. I'm the principal of this school. I can do whatever I want. You're in my house. Are you using a black voice? No, I don't hear color. All right, let's do some introductions. My name is Carrie. I'm here to make a little extra cash so that I can afford this warrant that I got. But that's none of y'all business. Welcome to night school. This book is kind of thick. I thought it'd be more like a leaflet. If you're not gonna do the work, drop the class. Just, no, I'm gonna do the work. You'll see. We'll see. Yes, we will. Great. Superb. Excellent. Good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 Yeah. You're gonna be a financial analyst? I am, and it starts immediately. I have been waiting on the Lord to bring me a pint-sized little man who can fill this out. Uh, come and get your chicken from the Lord. You take that test, or I tenderize your ass. I rebuke you. Take this damn suit off. Are you trying to get your GED? Are you trying to get your GED? Yes. yes. You can get out of my way, bitch. Suspicions were correct. <laughs> Boom. You're clinically dumb. There is no cure for what you have. Oh my God. I got learning herpes. I got the gift that keep on giving. Boy. You did the black voice thing with him? It's not a black voice. Not a black voice. You don't remember when you was in that meeting, you was like, we gonna get it lit up in here, this meeting lit. It was very lit. I keep it 100. When have I ever not kept it 100? Mm. First time at the El Royale? You have the option to stay in either California 
or Nevada. I always want to stay in the honeymoon suite, even though I'm not currently on my honeymoon. <laughs> what are you doing out here? I got a job singing in Reno tomorrow. Don't pay nothing, but uh, singing, singing. <laughs> this is not a place for a priest, Father. You shouldn't be here. It's a little too quiet in here. It gives me the willies. Sir, Can't take my eyes off you. we have a problem. You'd be like heaven to you watch me? I only watch who they tell me to watch. Who's they? Management. Did you think you could just take this mine and I wouldn't come and hunt? No, I figured you would. But I'd be ready when he did. Are you lost, Father? Can I confess something to you? I'm not really a priest. It's a game. It all starts with a simple choice. Would you mind opening the door? No, I ain't gonna do that. Which side are you on? Right, wrong, God or no God? Red or black? I've done horrible things. So does everybody. Shit happens. Get the whiskey. the secret headquarters of the SES. Stands for Smallfoot Exists, suckers! We have searched the entire mountain trying to find one. Whoa. And that day has finally arrived. Smallfoot. Oh my gosh, it's a Smallfoot! Where did it go? Reach into your memory. It got whisked away on the wind over the cloud. Which way, up, sideways? Down! Down, of course! He saw a small he foot. still be out there. He said it fell from the sky. Gary, calm down. You know how you get. Okay, I'll try, but I'm just so scared. Son, it can't be true. Migo, you will be banished from the village until you are ready to tell us the truth. I know what I saw, and I'm going to prove it. Is it too late to have second thoughts? Yes. Migo, uh, if you die, can I have all your worldly possessions? Gleam. Right, sorry, when you die. Let's do this. <laughs> No, 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 no. Ow. Standing here on my own. Yeah, the first step's the hardest when you walk in and soon. Hi, I'm. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I'm taking you home. We're gonna be safe here, nice and warm. <laughs> So warm. Wait a minute. What's how's that? Nice and toasty all the way around. Oh, hey, what's wrong? You hungry? I found your food.
are no like Halloween around here. I don't think this place is giving out candy. Haunted Halloween. Did you miss me? You discovered a walking, talking dummy and you didn't tell me? Okay, well he seemed like a really nice guy at the start. They're moving. So tiny and cute, what can they possibly do? Sonny, they're just gummy bears. on the moon that'd be something we've chosen a job so difficult requiring so many technological developments we're gonna have to start from scratch only after we master these tasks do we consider trying to land on the moon Neil, if this flight is successful, you'll go down in history. What kind of thoughts do you have about that? We're planning on the flight being successful. Damn, that is a big mother. It'll go up like a half kiloton A-bomb if it blows. The vehicle's not safe. We need to fail down here so we don't fail up there. This isn't just another trip, Neil. You're not just going to work. Do you think you're coming back? There are risks, but we have every intention of coming back. Somebody got a Swiss Army knife? A Swiss Army knife? Are you kidding me? Here we go. Six, five, four, three, two. Do you question whether the program's worth the cost in money and in lives? You're down here and you look up and you don't think about it too much, but space exploration changes your perception. And it allows us to see things that we should have seen a long time ago. We have serious problems. We've got this under control. You're a bunch of boys. You don't have anything under control. You should be extremely afraid. Thank you for bringing us collectively to this moment. It is a moment that so many have dreamed of claiming. History starts today. The guy you work for is an evil person. I don't work for him. My firm works for him. Are you gonna behave yourself tomorrow? I told you, I'm gonna do my job. I'm a reporter. I follow people that do not want to be followed. What about the allegations that you recruit the most vulnerable for tests that end up killing people? Your time to go. You finished, Mr. Brock. Is that a threat? You had to learn how to hide in plain sight. I'm pretty good at it, but you, 
You suck. Whoever you are. I work at the Life Foundation, and I need your help. We found something. We call them symbiotes. Carlton Drake believes that the union between human and symbiote is the key to our evolution. I'm feeling really sick. I'm hearing a voice. Eddie. You're not real. You were just in my head. I'm gonna need Mr. Drake's property back. I don't know. Why would we do that? If you're gonna stay, you will only hurt bad people. The way I see it, we can do whatever we want. Do we have a deal? Are you willing to sacrifice? The one thing you hold most dear. You should be extremely afraid. What the hell are you? We are Venom. <gasps> Maybe it's time to let the old ways down Maybe it's time to let the old ways down it Takes a lot to change, man Hell, it takes a lot to try You know, man, in the old days I always knew, like, you were gonna do something That you'd be all right it's the first time I'm worried about you. Can I ask you a personal question? Okay. Tell me something, girl. Do you write songs or anything? I don't sing my own songs. Why? I just don't feel comfortable. Why wouldn't you feel comfortable? Almost every single person has told me they like the way I sounded, but that they didn't like the way I look. I think you're beautiful. Hey. What? I just want to take another look at you. In all the good times I find myself longing for change. Here's what we're going to do. Come sing that song. What I love. No, I can't do that. Here, no. come on, here we go. Oh, that's not funny. Okay. Jack. Look at me. All you got to do is trust me. That's all you got to do. Shallow now.